Hey everybody, it's Hydrogon Lollipop. Last time we got Straybead44 and started the Demon Gate Trials. This time we're going to be getting Straybead65 in the second trial. Uh, the first one was actually pretty easy. It was easier than I had remembered. The second one is not going to be as easy. Um... I'm expecting this one. I'm going to probably take a decent amount of damage. Uh, we need Orca. Oh, there's Orca. I parked Orca around here. <laughs> when I did the fishing. Hey, Orca. Do not have my water thing on. Hi-ho, Yorka away. Orca. Now I'm trying to remember which island has it. I believe it's like with this one I'm aiming at. I don't see it on there. Let's go check. Oh, it is this one. And did Orca just leave by the way? No, okay. Here we go. The Demon Gate Trials, number two. Let it commence. Okay, we're starting off with the harder enemies. And as you can see, it's already taken multiple hits to kill these guys. This is what I was talking about when I said, oh, it's gonna be pretty hard. You guys are like, oh my gosh. Stop complaining. Look at this, look at this. With our strongest weapon. I'm going to need... Actually, no. It's a cherry bomb. Forgot how to bring these guys out of there. I am not going to be going for... Um, for the Demon Fangs. If I can get it, then that's good. But it's just so chaotic right now. I just want to be careful. To not die, or well, to not take damage, so we can get a ton of money. I'm gonna use a cherry bomb to get him out. You know, this is the first time I've actually been doing, or the mo most recent time I've actually been doing that. It's um, just all these enemies are so pathetic. I can just beat them up inside the ground, even with their de uh, even with their intense defense. And there we go. Defeated that. Nope, I did not. That's just, uh. Okay, just keep attacking this guy. This guy. Oh my gosh, it, it, they just keep coming. Here we go, come on. Let's take this guy out. Okay, is that the last one? I think it might be. There we go. I'm actually gonna write down on, there, let me just grab a piece of paper. I'm gonna like do, write down how many I've done. And uh, so I don't like get lost and keep, and I can keep track. Also, that took a little bit of time, and that was the first one. Um, we're going to probably want to miss this. I hate these things so much because they're so fast, and I already took damage from it. And apparently, mist is their floral finisher. And if we keep mist up, if they die while mist is up, we get the floral finisher from it. I'm gonna want to keep misting this fight. Just keep attacking. These ears. Let's miss again. Mist is gonna be our best friend in this fight. Cause these things go really fast. Let's keep attacking. Mist.
Missed. Misting. Misting. Oh my gosh. He is chaotic. And as you can see, we're getting tons and tons of money. The third trial, you're going to be getting so much money. Um, and I just got another, I just got a text. Okay. We'll just pound these guys. Um. Hate when they bring out their spears. Okay, because they can't do damage. Pound. Oh, oh, that was some damage. Or some, uh, godly charm something. Sure, I should probably take care of those guys up there. Just keep wailing on these guys. There's, the square button is going to be mashed so much. And there we go, another hit. Should probably be using wind a lot. Wind. I was going to try to do the floral finisher there, but I missed because I'm just mashing this button. Um, and by the way, this is not just a mashathon. You actually really have to be thinking about what you're doing. Um, you want to see if you want to do the jump attack. You want to see if you want to charge or just wail on him. I thought I did power slash. And if you use your, uh, if you hold down your triangle, you can lead that into some more combos and get some more, uh, stuff up quickly. If we do this, we can go into that and come out with that, uh, with your square button. So hold this down, do that, and this. And that will lead into some combos. Um, it's kind of like a fighter game, but it's 3D. I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. Um, uh, Amaterasu controls quite a bit. It's not, it's not like the quarter circle forward in the, um in the uh, Marvel vs. Capcom. It's more of a, it's more of an action game, but it's got quite a bit of that, that still uh, thing. And that was an easy one. That was an easy one. Oh wait, we just did two more? Let me just write that down. Uh, one, one. I'm just gonna use, um, I'm just gonna write this down so I can uh, keep track. I'm assuming the last one I'm going to have to cut into a couple parts. Uh, let's just keep wailing on these guys. Misting every single time it exits. And we are probably going to need to... Um, let me just get, get rid of the holy smoke. Uh, where should I put this? I'm going to be using some flame. Probably here is good. That'll be good against those guys. And then we can turn that into a... Wait, what the crap? Okay. Turn that into a mist. I know the miss is supposed to. I know the miss is supposed to be like this, but the game recognizes it as two. If there is are two lines that are broken, oh come on, missed. Wail on him. I hate these ones. These uh, these are some of my least favorite enemies. I'm I'm not sure why they're not actually that, that difficult. I don't know. I actually would prefer the. Um, even the f anything flying over these guys. I don't know why. I just don't like them. I find them annoying and too fast and... I don't know. Just keep wailing. And there we go. They're going to start going around the area. Just keep getting these. How many demon fangs do I have? Because I spent every single one I had last time. That's another one. Let me just write that down. That's four down, I believe, if I didn't miss one. Four down, I believe. I'm pretty sure. Power slash. Um, Christmas is coming up, so let's just talk about that. What are your guys' favorite uh, Christmas movies? I really like Christmas Vacation, which is an amazing movie. It's so funny. 
I also like Christmas Story a lot. I watch that as like a tradition every year. I did that when I grew up, and I really like that. You'll shoot your eye out. Um, but yeah, I really. Uh, what what are your, some of your favorite Christmas movies? Considering Christmas is like really close, it's the seventeenth when this is coming up, and holy crap. Um, I'm recording this a little bit ahead because I might be going somewhere over New Year's. And I just want to get a buffer of videos because I didn't really have one. I was like up to almost like recording and then the next day it was coming out. That was how bad it was. Also, check out this combo we're racking up. Check this out. 81. I think we just messed it up because of... Nope. Power slash you. Uh, let's see if we can get it to 99. And this is kind of crazy to do with a glaive, considering glaive is the slowest weapon. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. Even if you take a hit. I thought it was a, if you take a hit, you're done. There we go, 99. Rosary is pretty easy to get 99 with. Because uh, it's just so fast attacking. Not that much damage, but it's very fast. Glaive is the slowest of all of them, and it's kind of crazy to get a 99. But, yeah, you, you'll be getting high combos in here. All all of them, that's good. I can get all their uh, things out at once. Hiya! Feel the wrath of my 99. I think yours is a bomb. It's not in time. Ha! I urinate in your general direction. Look at that money. 51,000. Incredible. There we go. Five down, five to go, I believe. Um, that's if that's half if that's the kind of money you're getting from halfway through um through the second one. Actually holy crap, we're halfway through all of them, technically. The other one takes like an hour. The last one will take probably an hour. But uh considering we're oops, I hit start to try to bring up my menu. <laughs> uh considering we're about halfway, that's crazy. We just keep misting. And you'll and halfway and you're getting that much money? Yeah, trust me, you're gonna be making the you're gonna be easily making the two million for uh, Brown Rage. And don't worry, I will I will, I do wanna show off Brown Rage. It's a hilarious uh, thing. One of my favorites, and it's amazing to get uh, demon fangs from that. You get so many demon fangs so quickly from that. Just keep attacking. Keep attacking. Misting. Oh gosh. Come on. I don't want to waste time, but... I didn't want to um, get rid of my charged up attack by making to make a mist. And as you can hear, yes, I am mashing right now. <laughs> I'm just going all about the, hey, it's, we're not mashing the button. Um, that one's done, I believe. Is that six? I don't want to put my controller down. Yes, that's six. Um, the money will fluctuate a little bit. As you can see, we're only at thir we only got 30000 that time. But don't worry, you're going to be making a lot of money. I guarantee we'll have the two million after, the, uh, if not this one, the third one. Also, these guys go down really easily. They're very, very strong. I would never, never, never use wind on them, ever. Because then they go into, like, super, super Saiyan mode and are invincible for a short amount of time and do so much damage. Take off their mask and, oh my gosh, they're powerful. Don't ever use wind on them, ever. <laughs> I learned, I made my mistake. Is that really the end? Okay. There we go. Seven down. We're only 14 minutes in. This is crazy. Nuts. Oh, here we go. Also, you are going to be fighting some, like, mini-boss type things and some things you've never actually fought before in this. Which is actually kind of cool. Also, crap, 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 crap. Uh, they are using something to make my ink go down. Use an infinity stone for this fight. 
Um, they, they are sucking the ink away, but if you use Infinity, you will never have to worry about this. I'm actually going to end this right now with that Exorcism Slip. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to buy more Exorcism Slips. Well, I'm going to have to do that before the next one because you're going to be using them like mad. As you can see, an Exorcism Slip L did almost nothing to these things. So, trust me when I say it's pretty crazy hard. And especially the, the last one. Nuts. Uh, but you're going to want Infinity Stones on because they if they, they will pretty much be sucking your ink out the entire time and then you won't be able to do anything except for your wolf foo <laughs> which is basically what it is um let's keep attacking these foxes you killed rao i will kill you as you can see they're sucking the um ink away right now i'm not sure what the fire does but i don't want to step on it and they just keep spawning. Oh my gosh. I'll step, I'll step on it. Nothing. Okay. <laughs> also, my ink is... Uh, my Infinity Stone has run out, so they're sucking my ink away. Crap. I need another one. Okay. Keep attacking. Let's keep attacking. I better get a lot of money for this one. I'm using a ton of Infinity Stones, and those things are not cheap. Stop that. We're already at 99 with the Glaive again. The best thing to do with the Glaive, I think the most powerful attack, is to charge it up and then jump and then use that attack, because that does two. That's two consecutive hits, and holy crap, 62,000... We are, we have done eight, we have two more to do, and they're just gonna get harder from here. Okay. Okay, here's uh, the ogre things. Uh, these things, if you, they're not that bad. And I, now that I've said that, I'm probably gonna die. What you have to do is just basically jump behind them. If you're in front of them, you're gonna get hurt so bad, and you can't do any damage to them. Oh my gosh, this is bad. They are right in front of you. They're right inside of each other. So I'm going to keep getting hurt. I need Godly Charm. I need to use one of my new Godly Charm. And I already took damage. So it doesn't really matter now. Um, I only have... You know what? I'll use this. As you can see, it almost did nothing. But it stunned them. That's the thing that counts. Crap. I'm going to use... Um, I'm going to use a Steel Fist Sake. Cause we can we can buy some more crap after this fight. Ouch. And steel fist sake will increase my attack. Maybe I should uh, should not have sold my steel soul sakes. Do I have any? Oh, I do have some. I'll use. Oops. That'll increase my defense tremendously, so I don't take as much damage, and so I will be um. If, since I'm not going to use a Golly Charm and waste it since I've already taken damage in this fight, I will be uh, taking less damage, so, oh my gosh. Um, so, I can get more money from the end of this thing. Come on. Ouch. Just keep wailing on him. This is the ninth one. I am doing this a, this is a lot less uh, difficult than I remembered. And you just watch my health in case I need to use a holy bone. Which I don't think I will. Uh, just remember, they're going to keep wailing. And problem is with so many of them is that um, they'll probably be inside of each other. Meaning that, like that. Um, I'm uh, wailing on one, the other one comes up behind me and attacks. Come on. Just keep attacking. There we go. Oh, and more of them. I think there's the last one, maybe. Because there's not another one. Oh, never mind. Nope, nope. Okay. But, okay. This is something else I want to talk about. Um, this happened, like, I think it was two weeks ago now. But I never, I never got to talk about it. And I'm still not going to spoil what happens in it. Um, but in Walking Dead there was a character who died that oh my gosh that was awful um i know 
especially I know wait that was 10 I thought that was 9 well crap okay <laughs> let's write down 10 for that um well I guess we just got stray bead 65 <laughs> um but there was a character who died and oh my gosh that was probably one of the worst deaths I'm not gonna say who it is and you better not in the comments either because I know there are quite a few of my people including Ethan who sometimes watches these that has that watches it on Netflix and I know quite a few other people watch it uh, watch uh, Walking Dead on Netflix as it comes out because um, either they don't have AMC or just that but I watch it live and oh my gosh that was one of the worst that was the most climat probably one of the most climactic episodes since either the farm or the CDC that was incredible but um I'm not gonna say what else happens but yeah we're 20 minutes in so thank you all for watching or please subscribe next time we'll be getting stray bead 79 the last stray bead and the hardest one uh, before I leave first let me just see how much money we have we have like 1.4 million and we will be getting 2 million from this uh, last one if not I'll be surprised and completely shocked but um, before I end it off I'm going to buy some things that we're going to be needing for the next one I'm going to buy some exorcism, exorcism slips it's very hard to say that fast um, some exorcism slips, some vengeance slips, some steel fist sakes, and probably some holy bones. But, as soon as I get that, we will end off. Thank you all for watching, or please subscribe. Next time, we are going to be getting the last stray bead. Let's talk to this guy. The tool de dealer. Let's do some shopping. Bye. Oh, I need I need to deliver this herbal medicine. I think we should do that before this lets off. Um. Wait, where are the? He does not sell what? What? I would if I had known that I would have just stopped. Uh, actually, no. There's a guy in Kamaway who sells that stuff. I don't need to do this right now. Um, maybe he sells them. Oh, okay, okay. That actually kind of makes sense, uh, the attacking guy. I'm going to buy five, six uh, Steel Fist Sakes. I'm going to buy eight or 18. I'm going to buy 18 Exorcism Slip L's. And five of these just to make a bang happen. And then like five of these in case I just need a small bang. And I'll buy four of these. We should be all good. Ooh. I have 10 of those. I'm fine. Um, actually, you know what? I'll buy five more just in case. Don't worry. I, I'm almost positive we'll have enough money. And also, where to bring the herbal medicine in Okami? Um, sorry. I'm just going to Google this really quick. Um, in... Bring it to to Blossom, a woman standing on the west, west, western, on the western edge of town. Okay, let's bring it to her because we can uh, we could use some more money. She will be giving us tons of praise for it. I think it's actually her. Blossom, cool. Uh, we need to get rid of this herbal medicine. We've been holding it on for, a, for holding it for a while now. She doesn't believe it. The herbal medicine. We offered the herbal medicine. I don't believe it. You must have been sent by the dog. The the dog, Scotty. <laughs> and actually, I thought she was going to give us 50 praise. Okay. <laughs> Pops, is the medicine working? Oh, please let it work. Okay. Blossom's Papa. <gasps> sputter, sputter. Oh, what? You okay? Oh, what am I going to do? It's my father. He's lost consciousness again. Hey, Gramps, wake up. Um. There we go. Huh? How could you do that to a sick old man? Wait. Oh, that smell. I cannot resist. The cherry blossom of Scion City must be in full bloom. Time to eat, drink, and be merry on a happy day. And 20 more praise. 
He's gone. What the heck was that all about? Okay, and my father is, uh, has another illness which can't be cured. My father adores flower viewing festival, but he gets too excited and hurts his back every year. I made him promise not to go, but the flower fever struck again. <laughs> Thank you all for watching or please subscribe. Next time we'll be getting the final stray bead in Okami. Stray bead 79. <laughs> Hello. Shouldn't you be taking it easy? You were practically dead. Okay, well, thank you all for watching. Next time we'll be taking on the final trial of Demon Gates. The hardest one. Thank you all for watching. And goodbye.